Hi, in this tutorial we will be reviewing the basic features of Active Inspire software. To open Active Inspire, simply double click on the Active Inspire icon located on your desktop. When the program first opens, it defaults to a new flip chart page. You will see the toolbar to the right of your screen and the dashboard in the middle. The dashboard serves as a control panel, allowing you several options. From here you can open a new or saved flip chart, connect with Promethean Planet, access training or support resources, as well as a variety of other options. To access a new flip chart, simply close the dashboard. On the main toolbar you will see the buttons Next Page and Previous Page. These buttons allow you to move back and forth between the pages of your flip chart. To add a new page, simply click on Next Page and it will automatically add a new page for you. To write on your flip chart, click on the Pen button, select the color you would like to write in, and write using your pen or mouse on the flip chart. If the color that you want to use is not available on the color palette, simply right click and it will bring up more colors for you or you can choose the color wheel for a variety of other colors. To choose, change the pen width, click on the pen width tool. You can use the pre-selected pen width sizes or you can use the pen width slider to determine your new pen size. To use the highlighter tool, select the highlighter. Use the highlighter to draw over text or images. You could change the highlighter color by simply clicking on the color palette and choosing your new highlighter. You can also change the size of the highlighter by using the pen width tool. To erase what you have written, select the eraser tool. and simply erase over your mistakes. To change the background color, click on the fill tool, which looks like a paint bucket, select the color, and click on the flip chart. You can also add text to the flip chart. To add text, click on the text button, which looks like a big T, click on your flip chart, and type your message. Change the font, color, or size of the text. Simply double click on the text, highlighting all of the text or a portion, and go to the top toolbar to choose your new font, size, or color. You can move your text around by clicking on this and clicking on the X the crosshairs. You can add shapes to your flip chart by clicking on the shape tool, choosing your desired shape, and selecting the color you would like inside of the shape. You can change the outline of the shape color by clicking on the main, uh, color from the main palette. To add your shape to your flip chart, simply click and drag. You can change the size of your shape at any time by clicking on the select tool, selecting the shape, and clicking and dragging on the four corners. To undo a mistake or mistakes, click the undo button once or several times. To redo a mistake, click the redo button. To erase text or shapes from your flip chart, you can click the clear button. It looks like a squirt a water bottle. You will be given a variety of options on what you would like to clear. To clear annotations, you can get rid of your writing. 
if you want to undo that, you click undo. Shapes, objects, click undo. To clear the whole page, you click the recycle, reset page. Finally, you can click on the object and drag it to the recycle bin. If the recycle bin does not appear on your flip chart page, go to view on the top of your toolbar and select the flip chart trash can. Then simply drag and delete. These are the basic features of the Active Inspire software. Please take your time to play around and create your own flip chart for your classroom.